He's getting desperate now, yeah? He's getting pretty desperate, so on the last day, he starts lying to his friends and telling people, yeah, that he got a shag. But really, everyone knows he's a lying bastard. Walks into breakfast on the last day, yeah, walking in, and you've, oh, you've got a big smile on your face. Yeah, I fucked some girl last night. Oh, yeah? Did ya? What's she look like? Oh, 24. Blonde hair, blue eyes, tight ass, big tits. Oh, fucking night. <laughs> oh, fucking night I was doing her. Really? Yeah? Well, that ain't what we saw when we got back to the room about 4.30 a.m., yeah? We saw you laying out, passed out on the bed with your pants down by your ankles, with your cock in your hand, laying next to a fucking sock. Bit different tonight, aren't I? <laughs> Men, do you ever struggle looking for a little bit of loose change in your pocket? But really, you haven't got any loose change, you're just playing with your balls and a little bit of your dick. <laughs> Are you all right there, mate? You all right? Yeah, I fucking could have sworn I had a couple of quarters here somewhere, man. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, I've, been, oh, I've lost my phone as well, yeah. Men, do that, I'm doing it right now. No, it really was. Man, any, any excuse to play with their nutsack in public, men will do it. Yes, they will, you know? They're just checking on things, seeing how everybody is there. Is everybody all right? Can I get everyone anything? What do you want, coffee, iced tea, you okay? <sighs> Woo! Have you ever come back home, right, and found your roommate naked, on all fours, in the kitchen, right, with a happy face, written on his butt cheeks, yeah, with permanent masks, smacking himself with a hairbrush. No, mine has. <laughs> Men, do you ever get a boner for no apparent reason? What's going on down there? You sat in the office, you're on the bus, you're watching golf. You've got a great big boner happening. You can take care of it, because all you've got to do is sit down or oh, take care of it. But if you're out in public, yeah, and you've got this big old raging erection, what do you do with it? Now, there's an easy way, right? You go for the tuck, don't you? If you're wearing a pair of jeans or a strong pair of pants, it's an easy tuck fix. Not a problem, I'll deal with that, am I right? Got a belt on? No problem. It's like a strong mast on a good tall ship, yeah? <laughs> Strapped in behind that belt buckle. But if you are wearing a pair of sweatpants or some little, little panty thing, it, there's a whole other story come up there. But the worst, the worst is when you get a boner for no apparent reason and you're wearing a pair of shorts with no shirt on. There ain't much that you can do with that, so you're out having a swim in the sea, in the swimming pool. Darling, come on, get ready for dinner. No, I think I'm going to stay in the pool for a little bit. <laughs> you can't swim. Why is it? Get in, get out. So what you have to do, you have to do the tuck like that. People are like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> That's my other belly button.